So it's just a random Tuesday here in England when it's absolutely pissing it down. We're all stuck inside because some Chinese person ate a bat and I get a notification through on an old video. First from Leafy's video. Now, the name rings a bell from a channel that was probably only relevant in like 2016 when commentary YouTube was a thing. I am like, okay. I didn't think anything of it. Then I got another comment. So I decided, right, okay, let's go on and just, just see what people are talking about. He's uploaded a video called I slid into Belle Delphine's DMs. So I'm like, okay, so I don't understand how I'm any way relevant to this. And I don't understand how Belle Delphine is relevant in 2020 anyway, because literally she's like, I'm pretty convinced she's either dead or she's just gone back to being a normal person because she's made that many millions on Patreon for showing a fanny. You know what I mean? She's just disappeared off the face of the earth, as far as I'm aware, because Will and he's not making videos on her. We get Calvin. Crackhead. From America. Who goes and decides to make my day that little bit more interesting. So I sit there and watch through this video. First three minutes, 46 seconds... I do not give a toss about. Because I do not give a toss about Belle Delphine because she's irrelevant. Now, I'm not going to play the irrelevancy card, but all three of us are irrelevant as YouTubers. Just saying. He went from having like nearly 5 million to none. I went from having nearly 5,000 to 4,500 subscribers. So, we're all pretty irrelevant. Belle Delphine's stopped selling her bath water. She's, as far as I'm aware, not selling pictures of Fanny anymore. So, we're all pretty irrelevant. But somehow, a channel with f like 4.6 million subscribers has found my video with 200 and odd views. Somehow, I will never know how he found it or anything. Now, just a quick disclaimer, the video that he used is like 11 months old at this point. I had a fucking very dodgy trim and I didn't have my teeth in like I don't do now because I've got problems. I don't really care. And he goes and puts my video in his video. Now, could have at least left a link in the description or said my name or something. I'll give a shout out to channel. I, I get that's not the sort of person he is because he's a bit of a selfish cunt. Uh, I, I presume because I've not watched his videos like since 2016 when he was calling a girl racist because she doesn't like people of like Jews and stuff. That's literally like the only video of his that I can remember. Oh, and now she got a boob job. Yeah, that was interesting, to say the least. He's gone and put my video in his video. Now, bearing in mind, this video has like 280-odd views. That's mental that he's found that out of all... I literally went on before, I logged out on my YouTube channel, logged out of everything on Google, and just went to see if I could find the video. I couldn't find it. So how the fuck he found it? What, how many hours he must have spent scrolling? Well, whoever had made his videos scrolling through YouTube just to find. Uh, it baffles me. Now, bearing in mind, I wouldn't have even seen this if people hadn't commented on my videos. I'm like, how the fuck did you find it? You didn't fucking link it. I'm glad you found it, because maybe I got an extra subscriber. Fucking brilliant. Makes me feel better about myself. We're just going to watch my bit, because that's all I care about. Um, and also, I can't then get copyrighted because it's my material. Technically, I could take his video down if I wanted to. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Maybe we'll revenue share. Depends on what YouTube decide. Let's find out in the coming days, and I'll probably will update you in the comments. So check down there to find out what goes on. Literally, the first like half of the video is literally just other people's content. Like... But ladies and gentlemen, I have a bit of a surprise for you. Recently got paid some money, and I thought, you know what? I'm going to get some of Belle Delphine's bath water. You can tell by the way I'm acting that I'm taking the piss and doing it for clickbait. Let's watch and see what I do. And I know it says do not drink it on the website, but 
Surely the people in Africa drink worse. That's probably like borderline racist, just saying. So I apologise in advance. I love how this dude puts that annoying sound effect in there just to hide the fact that he's totally into this. He's going to pretend like he doesn't, but dude, he's just, oh my god, he, he's just fucking straight up chugging that. Hey, it's fucking water in a milk bottle. Literally. I don't know why we got milk in a milk bottle at that point, but we did. I was like, you know what? It's glass. It doesn't say anything on it. So I'll just fill it up with normal tap water, right? Which I know they don't get in America because, like, they don't know how to, like, filter water and stuff. So that's why they drink people's bath water because they're that fucking, you know, all there. But you can li you've in the video you've seen the other people with the little tubs. It's like a little tub that's about fucking that big. Fucking it says gamer girl bath water on it. That's just a fucking bottle. There's clear water in. It's like yeah, I think if I were like I don't think anyone <laughs> would enjoy drinking fucking stale water that some fucking slag has fucking what like flopped her legs around in what the fuck are you gonna get it it's probably just murky water she's probably not even been in it I'm like yeah I wouldn't mind sharing a bath with her but that's just weird <laughs> look at how you can tell that I'm taking the piss it's literally tap water oh and also about the sound effect because I swear at a period last year Every, like, YouTuber that was, like, trying to be funny, and I say funny in air quotes because you can tell it's fucking boring. Like, nobody watches this shit because it is literally just shit. I just remember there being all these, like, gurgling sound effects, so I did my own, literally into the microphone as I was editing it. I was like, <laughs> you can tell that it's me. And it's like, how the fuck does that say, like, I'm trying to hide the fact I'm into it? If I was like... If you're like, oh, 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 it's telling me all so much, then yeah, I could understand, like, your issue. But, yeah. I've never licked, I've out, never licked out a girl. I don't know why I said that. And I love that, I, yeah, I, I can see why that's believable. I've got, I've got to give him that. I first heard about Belle in one of Will and E's videos, and basically he paid for her... Highest end Patreon. What you'll notice is when I deliver to camera like I'm doing now, usually I'm not looking at the camera. It's it's a confidence thing. Like, depending on what I'm doing, I'm willing to look at the camera, whereas in this video I clearly wasn't confident because I stood there in my room, there were my window were open, there were people outside, and I talk quite loud. Like at the end of the day I don't care anymore, so I'm a bit more confident on camera because I've done it for a little bit longer. So I, I can look at the camera a bit better now. I'm still pretty bad. But we'll read for the comments after I've watched this. And it's literally all they say. Well, by the teeth. Elle is basically a 19-year-old girl who teases young boys in a very sexual way. Dude, what the fuck is wrong with this guy? She's Dude, what the fuck is wrong with this guy? I, I, I'm, I'm a bit wrong in the brain. But I don't get what he's trying to imply there. Whether I'm like sexually frustrated or something which i probably am but you know i'm just going to have a couple of tugs or something I don't he know. started selling merch not the sort of merch that you'd see other youtubers and people selling she's not selling t-shirts parents related maybe i don't it's basically calling me incest because i'm saying she doesn't sell t-shirts that is literally the main type of merch that YouTubers sell. Especially in the fucking UK where they've got no fucking brain cells. Like, oh, we'll sell a fucking t-shirt with the word KSI on it and people fucking love it. SDMN. Fucking smart. Just because she's had more brain cells, I'm like, I can use me funny to me advantage. Fucking pretend that I splash around in some water. Fucking sell it for 35 quid. Fucking, it's a joke. Like, I don't understand why he's like, oh yeah, you're inbred. Fucking, if anyone's inbred, it's fucking him because he's from fucking America. That's where they're all fucking in, says. Well, apart from Spain and stuff, but yeah. Fucking America is literally like the birthplace of incest, so. Yeah. Sweet home Alabama. 
Rain the skies are so blue. El Delphine. Okay, I know this topic is probably old, but I don't care. She's 19. English from Britain. Definitely a little bit of a power outage up top. Uh, not all the lights are on. I think he's trying to call me stupid there. I don't get his logic and his arguments, like, personally. But, hey hell, he can say what he likes. If I wanted bath water, I could actually go sit in the bath. I'd, although I'd struggle because I'm tall and fat. But still, I wouldn't pay $34, 35 for some bath water. But you did. But I didn't though, did I? Because it was a fucking milk bottle. Literally, fucking on side in the kitchen. So I just fucking ran in, filled it up with some water, come back and go, fucking chugging it. So, yeah. I still don't get how it's relevant in 2020. It's mental. But let's go on and find some comments. Because, mate, these comments are fucking brutal. <laughs> I just sat there reading this afternoon, like, hi, hey, it's me cool because you didn't link my video so i'm just like i'm not even gonna get clout from this that's a fucking joke uh, slap you know i'm silly into fucking little so it's just me like right so i'm the weird fucker with no teeth because you didn't share this oh, that's just fine uh, i'm a bit like why why the f f is that like why am i in a leafy video what have i done wrong okay mental and it's like literally all these people are just like, what's wrong with his face? At f four minutes, that guy looks like somebody's secret love child he had with his own mum, but his difference being his wife. It's like, mate, yous are fucking American. You are literally the epitome of inbred. Your dad is usually your pet goldfish and your mum's your sister. And she's also your grandma and you're married to her. 420, you might wanted to blur the man's face. We didn't want to see that. Well, you watch the video, you bellens. Oh, bro, why is that guy at four minutes look like Peter Griffin's had a stroke? Maybe because he's had a stroke? Yeah, probably. Probably did. So, mate, fucking hell, that's a bit violent. Look in there, like... That would be pretty funny, like, yeah, having strokes is funny, you know what I mean? Fucking normal. Let's, let's, let's try and read this from Sarah, who's probably a white woman with a fucking Black Lives Matter thing, because, you know, she's definitely not a racist, just pretending to be not racist. Because I'm pretty sure this comment is kind of racist. Brit British people's teeth really... Well, it's not fucking spelt right, you daft cow. Really be fucked up. Dude's teeth look stupid. It's not even a fucking word. What the fuck? Bro, you cracking jokes acting like US isn't capital of diabetes and being fat. Good shout. School shootings, yeah, even better. Mad Brits are funny, probably. Looks like that. It looks like he may have had a stroke. Why is everyone being an ass to him? Make fun of him for his actions, not his looks. It's sad to see some people just need to be need to this to be commented. I'm just every time I see he's like, what's his YouTube name? I'm just gonna like say hi, it's me. Just because I want the clout. How is his eye... How is my man's eyes shut like that? He looks so weird that he legit can't speak with his eyes open. Yeah, I told you that. It's my confidence. Want no confidence. Why are his teeth upside down? Because I'm mad. I can't tell if he's blind or he doesn't know how to express himself like a normal person or both. Hey, somebody's got fucking brain cells. A guy at 347 has a different jar than everyone else. He's probably joking. Hey, fucking somebody's actually got fucking brain cells, our kid. Fucking mental. What happened to this man's teeth, lol? <laughs> I don't care if he has some sort of problem that leads him to talk like that and have weird face expressions but the way he drank that and slurps and how he talks after <laughs> really just does me mate he rejumbled the video so it's not even in that order that was literally the last thing i did so it's not like i'm like mm, hey that's i don't have down syndrome maybe i think probably snorlox i don't know what that is so i'm just gonna ignore that Mate, that's just mean. I'm not fucking green. What the fuck? Do you want to slap or chin your dad? Oh, you... I was British. Oi, bruv, how you know 
he was British because I literally like to say it. Like I do, I'm pretty sure, yeah, I don't know, these fucking pe- Honestly, some of these people are just like, oh, fucking, I'm American, I don't want to fucking stand, I've got fucking half a brain cell in my fucking nose. Fucking too busy snorting meth and looking at my nan's asshole. Fucking brilliant. Hey, mate, they're all talking about just how I can't look at the camera, it's fucking mental. Right, if this creek got his teeth out, uh, this, it would actually look 10 out of 10. Do you want to fuck it? It's like, I'll chin your nan. Some of these people are just like not very nice. It just makes me a little bit sad. <laughs> Why did I read that building? <laughs> well, mate, what fucking building looks like that? It's a fucking shit architect. It says bulldog. So, yeah. Floppy, floppy, floppy cheeks. There's a hybrid between a man and a bulldog. Yeah, man. Fucking thing, you sister. Ha, so original. Mate, fucking life. That's what I'm high on you get, man. Hey, who the fuck's hoovering at this time of night? It's fucking five o'clock. You get me? I don't understand this whole obsession with, like, looking like I've been, like, stung by bees. Like, that's, like, quite a common theme as well. I, I don't get it, personally. But I'm obviously from England and I'm a bit slow, so... Mm. I just want to know, like, how he found the video. Like, honestly, I don't care. Like... It'd have been nice to have had a shout out, you get me, because then maybe make me a bit more relevant in 2020, because that is definitely something that I definitely want to be. Uh, but yeah, so thanks for watching this video. I suppose you'll never see this. I really don't give a fuck. The guy's probably more irrelevant than I am. That says a lot, because, you know, it. Fucking, at least I was relevant like 2018, not 2016. But hey ho, your nan is probably your cousin because you're from America if you're watching this. Because you know, fucking, he's mental. He's, he's there like, he's probably that inbred. And it's like, mate, your fucking nan is probably your fucking goldfish. What the fuck do you want to slap or chin your dad? Mate, these people need to get a grip of their life if they care that much about fucking Belle Delphine in 2020. She's fucking.